The man meticulously polished the bullet's tip until it was smooth. Then, he drilled a small hole in the bullet's head. Carefully, he dripped the highly toxic mercury from the pipette into the small hole in the bullet. A tremendously powerful poison bullet was now complete. Once this bullet hit his target, even if it didn't kill instantly, the mercury on the bullet's head was surely poisoned to death. Tom purchased various components online and subsequently assembled them into a sniper rifle. However, the sniper rifle was missing a suppressor. So, Tom intentionally damaged his car and took it for repairs. Seizing the opportunity while the boss was away fixing the car, Tom secretly searched for spare parts in the shop and took a gear iron plate with him. When he returned home, Tom dismantled each gear one by one, extracting the bearings from inside. Placing the iron plate in the center of a gear, he wielded a hammer and forcefully struck, knocking the bearing out. Tom carefully stacked the bearings together, slid them into a sleeve, tightened the sleeve cap, and a high-quality suppressor was ready. He mounted the suppressor onto the sniper rifle, and Tom headed to the riverside to test the rifle's shooting effectiveness. The accuracy and silencing effects were both exceptional. Tom brought all the components of the sniper rifle to the buyer. Jenny, the buyer, began assembling the sniper rifle. Tom silently timed her as Jenny swiftly and skillfully assembled the rifle. Tom realized that Jenny was an assassin. Once the assembly of the sniper rifle was complete, Jenny inserted a target several hundred meters away, loaded the rifle with bullets, aimed decisively, and fired. All three shots hit the bullseye. Jenny was satisfied with the accuracy. She wanted to test the silencing effect of the sniper rifle by having Tom stand at a distance of two meters while she fired. Tom fired two shots in quick succession, and the sound was so faint that the source couldn't be identified. Jenny was pleased with the sniper rifle. The next day, Jenny climbed onto the rooftop with the sniper rifle. Through the scope, she searched for her target. The person Jenny intended to eliminate was none other than Tom, the one who sold her the sniper rifle. Unaware of this situation, Tom was still engaged in a conversation with his girlfriend. Jenny decisively pulled the trigger, causing the top-notch assassin to fall from the rooftop.